Sister wives. Cody Brown passed by Christine twice for other women, but she waited. And Christine Brown wears. Dirty joke. Shirt about hubby. Also Janelle Brown shares side effect of mother's death. I will explain everything. Watch this video until end. Hey lovely viewers. Welcome to my shocking news channel. Sister wives celeb Cody Brown had a roving eye back in the day while Christine Brown waited for a spot to open up in his plural marriage. Christine is the first to admit she fell for Cody Brown and she believed she would join him at the start of his sister wives plural marriage. It seems there's something about this guy that his wives couldn't pass up. This was especially true for the third woman to join him in a plural marriage. Still, she thought she'd join the man of her dreams a lot sooner than she did. But this wife from the Sister Wives series was wrong. Sister Wives. Christine Brown waits for Cody Brown. Christine eventually became Mrs. Brown, the third wife in a polygamous marriage. But she endured some heartache as he passed her by twice by to marry other women. One got away but the other is still part of the Sister Wives clan today. Whether this reveal is the result of Christine saying too much or not, but she told the story of Cody's eye on a teenager. Cody, Mary Brown, and Christine Brown were all acquaintances due to their church. While Janelle Brown didn't belong to the same religious sector as the rest of them, she was married to Mary's brother. So, these women weren't strangers when their shared husband brought them on board the SS Sister Wives. Christine waited for a while for Cody to show interest in courting her. At one get-together, she brought a young teenage friend with her. Cody and Mary were there. One thing led to another and this teen became the next planned sister wife's wife. When Mary gave the news to Christine this crushed all her hopes of marrying Cody. She remembers how they told her. It happened when she went back to Cody's father's ranch for a visit. Mary and Cody were still in the monogamous stage of their marriage back then. The couple stood on the front porch looking tensely excited. Mary told Christine they were courting the teenaged girl that she introduced to them just a few months prior. This teen was going to marry Cody and become sister wife's number two wife once she turned 18. But that spot Christine had in mind. For herself. She was devastated. A young Christine Brown saw any chance of joining the sister wife's plural marriage gone for good. She admits in the book she penned with her sister wife's spouses that this girl was young and pretty. It collapsed her world. To add insult to injury, she introduced her to Mary and the man who would become the sister wife's patriarch. This news came at the same time Christine learned her parents were divorcing. Losing Cody coupled with her parents. Divorce rocked her world. She told her father that if any man shows interest in courting her, turn them down. She wasn't interested in courting any man. Christine didn't take all Mary's phone calls after that. It was too painful to hear about the courting of this girl. A week before the wedding that would change. Before the couple turned their marriage into a sister wives scenario, Mary called. This phone call she not only answered but it brought new hope into her life. The girl called the wedding off. The now third wife in the sister wife's family said it was the happiest day of her life. But that didn't last and Christine was passed by once again. Christine welcomed Mary and Cody back into her life. She was on track to join their family again and start the sister wife's lifestyle. Or so she thought. The future sister wife's patriarch talked with her as a friend, so one day he called to vent. He told Christine that this girl Janelle was driving him crazy. But she had no idea who he was talking about. He pointed out that Janelle attended some of the same events they've all been at. It seemed odd to her that this woman drives him crazy but her future sister wife's husband still associates with her. Apparently, she missed the full meaning behind, driving me crazy. The next thing she knew, he married Janelle and the three of them moved to Wyoming. So now Christine lost the man she thought was her soulmate not to mention her two best. Friends. After they settled in Wyoming, Mary called Christine to invite her to Cody's birthday party. She also wanted her to drive a group from the church to the party as well. Off she went and when she arrived, there was Cody with his two wives. When Christine found herself alone with Cody for a moment she told him out of all the men she knew she wanted Cody as a husband. The rest is sister wives history. Christine Brown endured a lot before becoming Cody's third sister wives wife. It seems the man who would create this sister wives family in the future, passed by twice. 
From what fans see of this wife on the show when she wants attention from her shared husband, she gets it. So chances are she gave off clues when around Cody Brown. Sister wives celeb Christine Brown started a whirlwind of chatter after she showed off one of her many t-shirts that display a message. Most of the sayings on her shirts are rather whimsical in a generic kind of way. But the sister, wives mom donned one this time around that seemed to supply her fans with a connotation she probably never intended. Sister wives, Christine Brown gets a gift from her biological sister. It seems Christine Brown believes three things here on earth are the result of Satan creating them. So, her biological sister knows about this, so she got her this shirt. Those three things that this sister wives lady considers spawns of the devil are bananas, hornets, and the anaconda. Apparently, Christine's sister saw the shirt and thought it was perfect for this sister wives star. So, this TLC celeb jokingly said she was going to burn it because it mentions an anaconda. Instead, she put it on. The shirt, the one this mom of six sports in the left photo below says, keep calm and love anacondas. So she let her sister wives followers take a look at her modeling this gift. But it started something that Christine probably wasn't expecting. While it's not the longest snake in the world, the green anaconda is the heaviest snake on earth. The biggest on record weighed over 500 pounds. It is a snake with a huge girth. Since it is so large that might be the foundation of the Freudian type mentions from her fans. Some fans chimed in to say that they don't understand what Christine sees in her shared sister wife's husband. They also don't get what her three co-wives see in the guy either. It's perplexing to many folks that the sister wife's patriarch managed to marry four intelligent women. Christine Brown's shirt probably was not a cryptic message about her husband. But some fans thought it might be. One fan even asked if she meant this shirt as a dirty joke. Christine and Mary Brown both sell clothing online. It seems their fan base from sister wives gives them plenty of customers. The third wife in the family wasn't looking to sell replicas of her anaconda shirt. But she often wears a piece of the attire she does sell in hopes of enticing some purchases. In the shot on the right above, Christine talks up her sweater to her sister wives enthusiasts. But it seems they don't find it appealing. While this mom of six goes on and on about how she loves a good sweater, some say the look is dated. Still, others don't see it doing much for her new thin figure. It seems that just showing her followers a gift from her sister, somehow this becomes misconstrued. So is she hinting that there's more to Cody than meets the eye. When fans ask what it is about Cody that four women find so irresistible, is this her go-to shirt to send them a message? Probably not. Most likely what you see is just Christine having fun and people reading something else into it. Sister wives Janelle Brown lost her mother recently and just shared an interesting side effect of losing this beloved family member. We reported last month, in December, that Cheryl Lee Brown passed away. Now, Janelle opened her home. After this loss, here's why. Sister wives, grieving Janelle Brown opens home. If you don't know about Janelle Brown's loss, her mother died on December 7th. And Cheryl Brown has a complicated backstory with her daughter and Cody Brown. That's because Cheryl was married to Cody's dad at one point, making his mother-in-law also his stepmother. Around the same period that Janelle married Cody and became part of the sister wives clan, her mother wed Cody's dad. Before their two marriages, neither Janelle nor Cheryl had ever been in a plural marriage. Her mom also popped up on the TLC show a few times. Cheryl Brown took up residence with Wynn Brown, Cody's father, on his ranch in Wyoming. Cheryl was widowed when Wynn died seven years ago. Then, in late 2020, Janelle Brown's mother also passed on. Now, Janelle's feeling the after-effects of this loss, and it's changed her life. Of course, losing her mother was a tragic life change for Janelle Brown. Now, the sister. Wives star said that she's taken in her mother's dog. She said her mother's, sweet pup, now lives with her. And she called the adorable doggy, see pic below, a, wonderful addition, to their home. In case you didn't know, Janelle from Sister Wives loves dogs. She advocates rescuing and has an 8-year-old rescue named Bryn. She also said the gray hair in her pup's face makes her sad. However, 
Janelle also said she hopes she has many more years ahead with Bryn. In addition to Bryn and her mother's dog, Janelle also has another rescue named Obadiah, Obi, a lab mix. The sister wife's spouse said Obi is an annoying little brother to her older canine Bryn. With the addition of her mom's dog, she now has three canines running around. No doubt Janelle misses her mother, Cheryl, but taking care of her pup is a nice way to honor her mother. The bigger question is whether Janelle Brown has enough room on her lap for another fur kid. In photos, her chewini, Bryn, often takes up most of her lap or sleeps on her feet. The sister wife's mom of six now has half as many dogs as children. And with her kids now grown, Janelle Brown likely enjoys having puppies to pamper and mother. And it's clear her fur babies are happy animals. Some of her favorite fur mom moments are when her animals cuddle together. So, we'll see how Janelle's new pet gets along with her other two dogs, Bryn and Obi. The sister wife's celeb often says that Obi's exuberance can wear out her older pup. But maybe her mom's dog will be able to handle the rambunctious younger dog. What do you think about this video? Please told on comment box also subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this video. Several other viewers add their thoughts. There were tons of PPL in that other thread who were like, David, I understand. Be you but Christine. Exploding head. People have really retconned Christine into this liberal feminist bra burning icon solely BC she left Cody polygamy LMAO. Lol they came from such a conservative religion I'm more shocked that anyone else was shocked. I think she appears supportive of that lifestyle because one of her children is LGBTQ+. I think many people are sympathetic who otherwise wouldn't be when someone they love is involved. I figured most of the Brown family and David were fundamentals. It was the way Christine was raised. She may have given up polygamy, but not her political beliefs. Other sister wives viewers discuss how Christine Brown's shift after marriage with Cody, Janelle, Mary, and Robin Brown hasn't changed her at the core. Let's not forget the only reason she left is because he no longer wanted an intimate marriage. Not because he mistreated her or children. She's as bad as the rest of them. Yes, that's why I immediately squashed that strong woman narrative. Her stands tried to portray. She would have still been there to this day had he not taken Dick off the table. That was her end point. Not the apathy, mistreatment, and inequity.